What is, I'm, I'm looking at, at four of the leading um, crypto platforms, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and Ripple, and the distribution of returns is extremely wide. Why is that? Well, you see the use case for each of those assets to be uh, different and aligned to areas of the industry that we really have to focus on. We can't necessarily paint with a broad stroke why Bitcoin would be rallying and why XRP would be uh, rallying in the same case. So you're going to see a divergence between certain coins, but also an overall all, rise, uh, all tides rise uh, effort when we see an activity towards uh, Bitcoin and the rest of the digital asset so give, market. Give, give me, give me an activity. example. You said that, that the, one, of the, one of the reasons why there is a, a dispersion of returns is that they have different use cases. Compare one against the other in, in light of those difference, different returns. Sure. You, you've got a store of value component with Bitcoin where people are seeing this as a, almost a flight to safety or mm -hmm. a flight to sovereignty for their sake. So when geopolitical situations become concerning, you're going to want to be able to hold your own assets and, and access those at any time 24-7. That's going to be a different case and scenario for something like XRP, which is really going to be useful for cross-border transactions, instantaneous settlements, and moving funds across borders. XRP is Ripple, right? Uh, yes, XRP okay. is actually uh, the digital asset. Ripple is a company. Oh, okay.